Hello everybody. Today we are going to show you how to do changing costumes and face expression for your character when you want it to. So we've got our little um drop here and this like red circle or whatever. And um I've already put in a bunch of different costumes of each emotion. There's meat, talk, angry, surprise, meh, sad. Once you have these set up, or whatever um, feelings you want it to have, then you time to add the script to events and bring out when flag click. forget to click save and make it set default costume this will be in the look section drag out switch costume to sad then change it to whatever one you want it to start out with now try pressing the green flag and see how it works I'm gonna switch it to sad now I'm going to flag and it automatically goes to meet so now what if we want it to ask you a question the sensing and bring out ask what's your name and wait then we'll ask something else like uh What is your favorite color? So now to control add an if then block right under the ask block. Now go to operators. Go down to blank equals blank. If it is true then any code inside of this block will activate. If not, then it will skip over. So now, instead of leaving this blank, the sensing once again, drag out the answer block. Place it into the first blank. Now, in the second blank, open a color, like blue. Then, Switch costume to talk. Blue. Then you can go to look, make it say its response to if you say the color blue. I love that color. Then you can make it after it's done talking. Switch meep, which is back in the look section. Let's try it. If you type your favorite colors to, it will say, I love that color, and then switch back after it's done talking. If you say something else, it will stay blank. This is where we go with the if then else block. Let's remove the if then block. The if then else block is basically the same, if that is not true. It will do another function. So if it is not blue, it says, oh, okay, not my favorite. And we'll set it to four seconds because it is a longer amount of text and we want the people to be able to read it. So now drag out switch costume to, and I'm going to go with meh. So let's type red. Okay, not my favorite though. We don't, if you want to switch before it says it, your block placement is actually pretty important. Sometimes you want it to switch to meh first and say it's not my favorite. Or do you want it to switch to meh right? It all depends on where you place your block.
So then, you can make it have different reactions to different things, and you can right click on a block, click duplicate, make a new version of that block. Here's where it gets a little complicated. Let's remove the previous code and put in another if then else that is the same. If it is not blue, the answer is red, then it also loves that color. If else, it'll do that other code that we just deleted. So now we can pick blue, I love that color. Or red, also I love that color. Let's make a different reaction. It all depends on the switch costume block. It's about it hates red. So let's do red. Hate red, uh. We want a different reaction to it. So let's try this. So now it gets angry if you pick red. If you think this is confusing, click on the gray part of the editor and go to add comment. Then you can label your script so you won't get confused if you add a lot of scripting. So you can say triggers a function color blue is type. You can shorten it right there. You can go that so it's nice and short and attach it to a script like I did. Then you can open it if you forget. Here's a function if the color blue is typed. You can make as many of these comments as you want. And you can make abbreviations for yourself and other stuff like that. So you can also make or inside blocks and stuff like that. We are going to talk about some other stuff in the next episode. I hope you learned something about Scratch. Um, hopefully, um, you enjoyed this video and my voice wasn't too glitchy. If you did, please hit the like and subscribe button um, on our channel and leave a comment down below i guess um hopefully this helped someone um if they didn't know how um again please like and subscribe thank you for watching bye